Well, Something Wild is the title of a new thriller, and News 9 arts critic Judith Chris tells us just how wild the movie really is. Something Wild, a new comedy thriller by Jonathan Demme, starts out as still another story of the uptight guy who's loosened up by a kooky lady. Jeff Daniels is the new vice president of a tax consultant firm skipping out on his lunch check in a Manhattan diner when he's accosted by Melanie Griffith, as kooky as can be. Fine, maybe you'd like to tell a cop. No, don't, no, don't, no, don't. Let me guess. Sometimes you don't pay for your lunch. Or maybe you steal the occasional candy bar or newspaper. You're a closet rebel. She then gets him out of the closet with their taking off for New Jersey, with stops at a quickie motel, a visit to Griffith's mother, with Griffith passing Daniels off as her husband and changing from a brunette to a blonde, and then a stop at her high school class's 10th reunion, where Jack Gilpin and Sue Tissue accost them. Uh, Mary, this is Audrey. This, we're, we've known each other. We're lovers. Well, only in the sense that, you know, all human beings are uh, lovers. Audrey Biggs. Well, I had to take his name for the baby's sake. He's having his child? I think it's his child. Larry works in accounting. He's just down, down, you know, down the hall from me, right? Is this the guy who would have wondered what you were using company plastic for yesterday afternoon in that motel in New Jersey? It's at this point that the comedy turns into a thriller, with Griffith's high school boyfriend, an ex-con, turning up, and Daniel's on his own, undergoing another change of character to keep up with Griffith and her new involvement. And suddenly, we're in a life-threatening and ferocious situation. The end's not unexpected, and the soundtrack's overloaded with songs, but once something wild gets really wild, with Daniel's and Griffith and Demi's fringe comedy at their best, the movie makes its mark as offbeat entertainment. For News 9, I'm Judith Christ.